Hey, Lily, are you smarter than a kindergartner? Sometimes. Sometimes. Well, I have a riddle for you. What, what belongs to you but gets used by everyone else more than you? My phone. Your phone? Yeah. Other people use your phone more than you do? Mm -hmm. Wow, I was gonna say your name because you own your name, but most that's okay, that's okay. That was good here. Let's, let's try one more, let's try one more, you ready? What can you hold on to, but never touch it at all? Don't say your phone. No. The wall? <laughs> the wall. Well, no, you can't hold it. The wall. How about a conversation? Oh. Yeah, that was pretty bad. If you guys want more of these, make sure you guys subscribe. And how smart are you? Super smart. Super smart. Yeah. Okay, there's a bowl of five apples. Okay. And you take away three apples. Okay. How many apples do you have? Two. Zero. I don't have any apples right now. <laughs> <laughs> you take away three apples. You have three apples. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> make sure you guys subscribe for some more. Are you smarter than a kindergartner? George, how smart are you? Smarter than a kindergartner. Oh, let's find out. Okay. A cowboy rides into town on Friday and stays three days, but then he rides out on Friday. How is that possible? Wait, so a cowboy? Yes. Goes into town. On Friday. On Friday. And then- Stays three days. Stays three days. And then rides out on Friday. How's that possible? He rides out of his house on Friday, but he doesn't ride out of the town. <laughs> His horse's name is Friday. Oh, oh, here, here. Let's give him one more. Let's give him one but that, more. But that was, that was true, though. All right, no, let's give him one more. He okay, one brain. more. Yeah. Unfortunately, the vice president dies. Who acts as president? The president? Dude, you got it! Oh, I got it! Yes! I got it! I got it. I got it. How smart are you girls? Smart than a kindergarten. All right, let's find out. You ready? Yes. How is it possible for every single person to die in a plane crash, but two people survived? <laughs> oh, she knows. They were, they were, um, they were, they, I know. They because they're, they weren't in a plane crash. No, they, yeah, they, they were in a plane <laughs> they were, crash. They were like on the border of like the... <laughs> Wrong question. You're thinking of a totally different one. Nope, not that one. Wait, say this again. How is it possible for every single person to die in a plane crash, but two people survived? It's not it's possible. No, no. I know the answer. Then tell us. I can't think of it. <laughs> All the single people died. The two people that were that lived. No, because they were married. They were married. <laughs> All right, you got it. Give her a round of applause. <laughs> so how smart are you? Uh, I don't know. Okay, how can you go 25 days without sleeping? I don't know. You sleep at night. I didn't even get that one. Yeah, come no. on! That was no. Totally, all right. I told you. All right, how about this? How many seconds in a year? How many seconds in a year? Okay, a year, three, that's easy. Three, three, wait, three. Thirteen. What? I don't know how many. Three and six. There are twelve. Like January second, February second, March second. Yeah. Okay. All right. One more. One more. One more. Come on. If you get this. I'm getting this. You are. You have to. This is the simplest one. Are you ready? Yes, I am. Ready. If the vice president dies, who acts as president? The president. Yes, he got it! Yes! Make sure you guys subscribe for more! All right, how smart are you? Uh, extremely. Extremely. What is one eye but can't see a thing? Blind. <laughs> what? Blind. What do you mean blind? Blind. No, an, a needle has one eye at the top ah, and can't see it. Okay. Never mind. Let's try, let's try an easier one. Let's try an easier one. You go no, into- That was too sophisticated. Oh you. my gosh. Let's try this. You go into a dark room, okay? You have one match. What do you light first? The kindling, the oil lamp, or the newspaper? Oil lamp. No, the match. You only have one match. Oh. Yes, I'm in the dark. No, no, no. Okay. Yeah, you're in the dark. That's good. All right, one more. Okay. You have to get right, this. Right. You guys have to try as well. You ready? Yeah. How many times can you subtract 10 from 100? Uh, nine. No, you can only subtract it once because every other time you'd be subtracting from 90, 80, 70, and so on. <laughs> Make sure you guys subscribe. Hey, Leslie, how smart are you, man? Very smart. Very smart. Too smart. Oh, too smart. Why is it illegal for a man living in North Carolina to be buried in South Carolina? Um, because it is not the same state? No, because if he's living in North Carolina, he's still alive. 
Oh. It's illegal to bury people oh, if they're okay. still alive. I had to try, try another one. Try another one. I, it's all good. Here, listen. How about this one? That's pretty dumb. I know. If Sally has four piles of sand and Johnny has five piles of sand, if they put their piles together, how many piles do they have? Ten. Nine. Yeah, nine. Yeah. Dude, if they put their sand piles together, yeah, it would just be one big pile. <laughs> Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys want to see more. Make some noise! Yeah. How smart are you? Really smart. Really smart. Say the word silk five times. Silk, 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 silk. What, what do cows drink? Milk. Milk? <laughs> or water? <laughs> All right, here. Let's try another one. Let's try another one. That was, that was an easy one. I've done that one before. All right. A rooster's on top of a building and it lays an egg. Which way does it fall? To the west or to the east? East. Roosters don't lay eggs. No, they don't. No, chickens do. All right, here, try one more. <laughs> try one more. You can I'm, do this. I'm really excited now. No, no, you got this. Video. <laughs> this is a very easy one. All right, redeem yourself. If the vice president dies, who acts as president? The president. He got it. Yes. <laughs> Make sure you guys subscribe for more. So how smart are you? Not that smart. Not that smart. Well, let's find out. You ready? Fire away. Okay. What makes you young? My wife. That's a good answer. But if you add an N and a G after you, it would make it young. That's what would make you young. Uh, oh, okay. Maybe that was, maybe that was, here we go, here we go. okay. That was maybe a little bit too over his head. So let's do something a little bit easier. You ready? How could you possibly shave every single day, multiple times a day and still have a long beard? No idea, man. You'd be a barber. Oh, oh, there it is. Make sure you guys subscribe for more trick questions. Are you ready, Graham? I swear to you. How smart are you? Pretty smart. Pretty smart. Or do me a favor. Say the word silk five times. Silk, 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 silk. What do cows drink? Me? What, uh, what do cows drink? Yeah. They drink water. <laughs> wow. She got it right. Well, here, let's try another one. Say roast five times. Roast, 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 and roast. What do you put in the toaster? Bread. <laughs> wow, Grandma. No one has ever gotten all three. This is the last one. You ready? Yes. Say mop five times. Mop, 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 mop. <laughs> and what do you do at a green light? Go. Oh, my gosh. Grandma got them all right. You guys need to up your game. Make sure you guys subscribe. All right, Graham, you got me on the first one. I'm gonna get you this time. You ready? I'm ready. You have six teacups and you take one away. How many cups do you have left? I uh, 59. I got her. I well, if you have six teacups oh. and you take one away, you'd have five teacups. Oh yeah, I thought you said 59. I, I know, most people didn't. Let's try another one, let's try another one. If you have 26 cats and one dies, how many cats do you have left? 25. No, 26 cats. One dies, you'd have 19 sick cats. <laughs> All right, one more, Graham. You ready? Here we go. What does C-A-T spell? Cat. D-O-G. Dog. Yeah. yeah. If T-W-A was a word, what would it sound like? Wah. T-W-E. We. T-W-I. T-W-O. Whoa. No, that's two. I think I got grandma on this one. <laughs> What's going on, Ross? Oh, man, having a great day. Happy to see you again, I'm Smith brother. You, you ready? Yeah. How smart are you? Not very smart. Well, here, what, what, what starts with an E, ends with an E, and has only one letter in it? Damn it, this is a trick question. But it I'm sure is. I'm gonna say E, I don't know. An envelope. Starts with an E, ends with an E, and has a letter. Okay, dude, you're, you're putting me on the spot. Okay, okay, okay. 30 seconds. All right, here, to get these one right. more, one more, one more. You ready? Yeah. What breaks and never falls? What never falls and always breaks? Ah, Rick. My head hurts. <laughs> Do I have to guess? Yeah, guess. Breaks and never falls and falls and never breaks? Yeah. Gosh, I'm so bad at riddles. <laughs> How about the day breaks and the night falls? Yeah, I would have never. Yeah, these that. are pretty we bad. We're gonna be here all day. Well, that's okay, but hey, make sure you guys subscribe if you want to see more Frost Smith. You don't because <laughs> I'm an idiot. So, Todd, how smart are you? Uh, as smart as Siri. Wow. All right. Two coins equals thirty cents. One of the coins is not a quarter. What two coins do you have? 
two coins equals 30 cents. One of the coins, not a quarter. Yeah. Uh, a dime. <laughs> a dime? <laughs> a quarter and a nickel. Oh. Yeah, because one of the coins is not a quarter. The other one is. A quarter of what? A quarter and a nickel is 30 cents. Oh, okay. Do you get it? No. Oh, my gosh. All right, one more, one more, just for you. You ready? You're flying your very own private jet from Ohio to Pennsylvania. You crash on the border. Where do you bury the survivors, Ohio or Pennsylvania? Don't New, Jersey. <laughs> New Jersey. New Jersey. <laughs> you don't bury the survivors. They're still New alive. They said New Jersey. If you guys want to see more of this guy, make sure you guys subscribe. So how smart are you? I think I'm pretty smart. Really? Yeah. You've seen these on my channel. I have. That's the first thing I said. Do you want to go on? Okay, here? okay. So I want you to name three consecutive days without using Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. Three consecutive days. So uh, without using Wednesday, Wednesday Friday, Friday, or Sunday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday? No, you can't use Sunday. Oh. Uh, Tuesday, what? No. Uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday? No. No, can't. I don't know. Yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Uh, Okay, okay. So Nick, how smart are you? I'm very smart. Rick. Smarter than a kindergartner? I think so. How could a man shave every single day and still have a long beard? I don't know. He'd be a barber. <laughs> Such a good... How do you make you young? I don't know how, Rick. You add an N and a G, and then you would, you would <laughs> <laughs> subscribe for more. Max, how smart are you? Not. <laughs> You're not. Are you smarter than a kindergartner? Let's see. Okay, what goes up and down but remains in the same place? The equator. <laughs> the equator. <laughs> I don't know. Stairs. Oh. Stairs go up and down. Okay. Again. Here, let's try one more. Okay. okay, if you're really smart, you should be able to get this. Okay. All right? An electric train is going from north to south, okay? Mm -hmm. And the wind is blowing from east to west. Uh-huh. Which way is the smoke blowing? Wait, what, what way is the train going? <laughs> Come on. Oh, wait, it's electric. It is. He got one right, so make sure you guys are subscribed. Not help from anything else. <laughs> so are you smarter than a kindergartner? Yeah. You are? I think so. Okay, you ready? Answer this question. How long is the answer to this question? How long is the answer to this question? I don't know. I just told you. How long is the answer to this question? <laughs> how long? That was pretty good. Make sure you guys subscribe for some more. What's going on, man? Are you smarter than a kindergartner? Uh, yes. Yes. What tastes better than it smells? Uh, I don't know. Your, your tongue. Oh. Yeah, your tongue tastes better than your nose. You can't taste with your nose. All right, here, try this one. Try this one. Maybe this, maybe this will be easier. You ready? Say unique New York three times. Unique New York, unique New York, unique New York, unique New York. Unique New York? Unique 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 Boys and girls, make some noise for this guy. <laughs> What's going on, Rich? We're doing magic with you. Okay, are you smarter than a kindergartner? God, I hope so. You hope so. <laughs> and you're good with numbers? I'm all right. How many six cent stamps in a dozen? <laughs> Two. Two. Oh, a six dozen. dozen. <laughs> There's 12. 12 six cent stamps in a dozen. You want to see more of this guy, make sure you guys subscribe. Hey, Kent, how smart are you? Smarter than a kindergartner. Oh, really? Well, how about this? What weighs more, a pound of bricks or a pound of feathers? Well, technically, they're the same, but with the feathers, you have to carry around with you the weight of what you did to those poor birds. What kind of answer is that? Make sure you guys subscribe for more. So how smart are you? Um, smarter than a fifth. You enter a very, very dark room with one match. I want you to tell me right now, what would you light first? The oil lamp, the kindling, or the newspaper? What would you light first? The match. Oh my gosh, you got it right. <laughs> Are you smarter than a kindergartner? Probably not. Probably not? <laughs> what moves faster, heat or cold? Light. Cold. No, <laughs> heat, because you can always catch a cold. Oh. All right, that's a bad one. All right, well, this is an easy one. I put it on the channel before. Let's see if you can get it. You ready? Mm -hmm. Say the word silk five times. Silk, 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 silk. What do cows drink? Milk. <laughs> Water. What? You gotta watch these videos. 
Hey, Logan, how smart are you? Not very smart. Oh, come on. <laughs> are you smarter than a kindergartner? Yeah. How about smarter than a fifth grader? A lot smarter. Oh, a lot smarter. Okay, ready? Answer quickly. Say the word roast five times. Roast, 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 roast. What do you put in the toaster? <laughs> toast. Put toast? Toast. How toast. about how about bread? Uh, yeah, you put yeah, bread. Yeah, bread goes in the toaster. Toast comes out. Try another one. Try another one. Spelling test. Kindergarten level. What does C-A-T spell? C. <laughs> Let's try that again. C A T. Sat. Sat. This is not hypnosis, you guys. Try one last time. C A T. Let me give you a hint. Meow. Oh. Cat. Yeah. How about how about D O G? Dog. Good. If T W A was a word, how would it sound? Twa. Twa. T W E. Twee. T W I. Twi. T W O. Two. Or two. Chance, are you smarter than a kindergartner? I think. What two things can you never eat for breakfast? Food? I don't know. Food? <laughs> what two things can you never eat for breakfast? Lunch and dinner. I knew it! I knew it! <laughs> Wait, come here, come here, come here. What word, what word is spelled incorrectly in every single dictionary? Incorrectly. You, you got it. Come on, you guys, give Chance a round of applause. Hey, Kieran, how smart are you? I'm pretty smart, I think. Are you smarter than a kindergartner? I don't know. You don't know? What grade are you in? I'm in fourth grade. Fourth grade, all right. A red house is made out of red bricks. A blue house is made out of blue bricks. An orange house is made out of orange bricks. What's a greenhouse made out of? Glass. Dude, he got it! All right, one more, one more, ready? This kid's smart. Did you hear that one before? Yeah. Oh, well that's not good. Here, we'll try another one. Say mop five times. Mop, 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 mop. What do you do to green light? Huh? What do you do to green light? You stop. No! Oh gosh. No! Don't stop at a green light. You go. Here on you go. Make some noise, everybody! <laughs> Mrs. Cook, are you smarter than a kindergartner? Yes. Okay, you are flying your very own airplane from Ohio to Pennsylvania. Unfortunately, your plane crashes right on the border of Ohio and Pennsylvania. Where would you bury the survivors, Ohio or Pennsylvania? They survived. So what do you do? I wouldn't bury them. Good job, she got it right! <laughs> All right, that's one. Okay. Think about it carefully. If the Vice President of the United States dies, who acts as President? Our current President. Oh my gosh, she got two for two, you guys. <laughs> Make some noise for your teacher! <laughs> hey Adam, are you smarter than a kindergartner? I think so. You, you think, you think so. <laughs> what appears once in a minute, twice in a moment, but never in a thousand years? Um, your age. <laughs> your age? This is terrible. The letter M. Oh. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let's do one more. Let's do one more. Let's do one. What is owned by you, but more people use it than you do? My name. That's right! He got it! <laughs> so, Mrs. Marlowe, are you smarter than a kindergartner? Yes. Okay, good. How many six cent stamps in a dozen? There's 60 in a dozen. 60 in a dozen. What do you teach? ELA. There's 12 in a dozen. Okay, here, try, try another one. Try another one. That was, that was really hard. Don't be nervous. Don't be nervous. Ready? Here. This is an easy one. Ready? Five plus five. Ten. That's good. Seven plus three. Ten. Eight plus two. Ten. Nine plus one. Ten. What's an aluminum can made from? Tim. No. Aluminum. No. <laughs> Make some noise for Mrs. Martin. Are you smarter than a kindergartner? Probably not. Oh my goodness. Let's try it. You ready? This is so simple. Ready? <laughs> Pam's mother had three kids. Penny, Nickel, and... Dime. No! Pam! Pam's mom had three kids. Penny, Nickel, and... Pam! <laughs> yes!